Hi guys, this is Panther Sam back with another video, and today I'm going to be reacting to Lamar Jackson being selected as the Madden 21 cover. So, first, let's go over, obviously Lamar Jackson was the MVP last year, but I'm going to currently go over what his stats were for the last, for 2019 season. So he had, he threw 265 passes, or completed 265 passes through 401. So that gives you a 66.1 completion percentage, which is pretty good, I guess. And he got 3,127 yards, 36 touchdowns to only six interceptions. And then rushing-wise, obviously what he was known for coming out of college, he had 176 attempts, 1,206 yards, and seven TDs. So obviously he won the MVP, so stats are pretty good. Carried his team to the divisional round. Obviously they lost to the Titans. Kind of sad if you're a Ravens fan, number one seed. You lose at home in your first game, not very happy. But I wanted to see the Titans win that game just because it was a good underdog story. So, yeah. So, I think this show, and then also I think it's a good move by EA. Because now they're getting, like, probably the, arguably the best player in the NFL. Most likely the best quarterback. You could say maybe say Patrick Mahomes, but I would say Lamar is most likely the best quarterback in the league right now. And he'll be the face of the cover, so that's good. You get some good sales going on to the next-gen consoles, which I don't know if Man 21 is going to be released on the next-gen. I'm assuming they will, but I'm not 100% sure on that. So, uh, please like the video and subscribe to the channel. It would really mean a lot to me. And if you haven't already, go check out the gaming channel. I'll put a link right here. And thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. We got and uh, just to let you know, I know this is a double upload. I just wanted to get this out because it just broke. So, yeah, but uh, thank you guys for watching. See you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.